Hi friends, so it is Friday. Um, as you can see, I'm not at home. We are <laughs> in a hotel. Um, we've literally just arrived. We are in London for the weekend, which is very nice. Um, this was my travel outfit. So I've just got my blazer, this little crop top, leather leggings, and then my Uggs. Um, I love these Uggs, they're like, yeah. But anyways, just thought I'd come on, do a little weekend vlog for you guys in London, because obviously it's quite different to the usual stuff of what we do. My battery is dying on this and I forgot to bring a spare one, so I will be vlogging on my phone. Um, but yeah, this is the room quickly before everything dies. Um, it's just a premiere in, so, oh, I don't know where the light is for the bathroom. Um, ah, no, that's the light for the room. This is the bathroom. So we are in the Premier Plus room. Um, so it is kind of like an upgraded version of your Premier Inn. Um, we've got the mini fridge down here with some water, an espresso machine, cups, coffees, all of that. And this is the view. So yeah, I'm gonna go because I have about an hour to get ready now. My battery's dying. Um, but yeah, speak to you guys in a little bit when we get to the restaurant. Something to say, blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why are you going nowhere special? Just going to the store I think I'd have it all, tell you why I'd be more Picking the plate, being a plate She is unruly Never seen her like this Didn't think it existed, no truly I'm getting away, she's not here to play She'll get moved Take this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules This is someone else I'm not myself, no, no Problems disappear She could tell you the things you wanna hear She could read your mind and that she could believe Of a little lies to tell yourself it Never get it wrong, it's always right Making the play, being the play She is on a rule, Never seen it like this Didn't think it existed, no truth Okay, so we're back now. I just thought I'd show a little OOTD while my husband sorts out the room. So this is the dress that I wore. Um, it's from River Island, I believe. Um, I wore my black Zara blazer on top. Um, some black tights, these boots, knee-high boots, boots. <laughs> from 
I don't know. Can't remember. ASOS. ASOS. Yes, ASOS. Anyways. And then my Brandon Blackwood bag that says oh, yeah. End Systemic Racism. Oh, yeah. So this was this was me. But yeah. I only had my bag like this because we were on the tube. Um but I just carried it by the handle. And then this was it. Without the bag. Cute. It's just like a flap. So it's got like a thing here. Super cute. The dress. It's giving grown, but sexy. But kind of like I'm a mom. Cute. And cute. Um, earrings are... I don't know where from, I can't remember. I've had them for a while. Apple Watch, bracelet from my mother in law, necklace from my mother in law, necklace from my husband, necklace from my sister. Gonna wind down for the night and get cozy, watch a movie, and sleep because I'm exhausted. Bye, y'all. Okay, I'm putting my bag away for me. Even though everything is still in my bag. <laughs> it's not even empty in my bag, but he's putting it in the dust bag. It's alright. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. I'm just going to sit here. Something to say, blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why are you going nowhere special? Just going to the store I think I'd have it all, tell you why I've even more Picking a plate, being a plate She is unruly Never seen her like this Didn't think it existed, no truly I'm getting away Hi y'all, so we're back in the car this is our final afternoon in London. That's because it didn't push down. He's complaining about the bit. Okay, so we've just finished. We went into the shopping centre. Um, I'm vlogging on my phone because my camera died and I forgot to bring the spare battery with me because that's just what we do. Um, my husband's back there trying to sort the suitcases. So we went to a couple of places, stopped in office to look at some shoes, um, just browsing, and then we went to H Samuel because he had to get a link taken, put back on his watch, because his watch was a bit tight. And then we went into, where did we go? Goldsmiths. Um, that's where I got my rings from. So we were just browsing around a bit. And then we went to Starbucks. Um, I got a kombucha. Yes, please. Thanks, love. Sanitizing. It's a Starbucks haul. Computer. Okay, wait, what do you mean? Computer. Mango passion. Got a ham and cheese croissant. Um, I don't think we've ever had one from Starbucks before, have we? Oh, yeah. Um, I got this amazing.
using this up cup because it was just beautiful and it was the last one on the shelf so I feel like this is me in a cup bibs why are you look so I don't know it's I was like, I'm, so I'm just figuring there's much that went to it before this time. <laughs> so, yeah. Maybe we'll have some. Yeah. Um, last thing was eggnog latte. It is Christmas season. And eggnog is my favorite drink that Starbucks has ever done. So, I'm very excited about this. And that was it. And now, we're off. I already told him that when you ate the <laughs> And he also got an eggnog latte, but a smaller one. So. He hasn't tried it yet. Uh, he got vegan cream on top because he thought it came with cream. Is that funny? <laughs> she made this strong. I'm tasting coffee. That's what it came with coffee. Zero in your one is coffee. Yeah, but she knew yours was the smaller one. Mm. I'm sorry, yours. It's still good though. Mm. Still great. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna have to get some egg milk babes. Mm. I can make some egg milk lattes. Okay. We're off. Hi lovelies, welcome back. It is currently Tuesday and my last vlog you would have seen I had a weekend away in London with my husband uh, just a little bit of us time so now we are back Um, it's currently midday I did a vlog this morning it's you know when you come back off a holiday and your first day you're just you just got stuff to do i had emails to go through just stuff to do so all of that is like i'm finalizing some po's um and invoices at the moment so yeah it's been a bit of a non-eventful morning um although i lie I went to the gym this morning, got up at 6am, went to the gym for 7, which was very nice. Um, I felt very nauseous though, which was not great, but I think it's just because I haven't been to the gym in a while, and I think it might also be because I ate before the gym, and I never ever usually eat before I go to the gym. Gym. Did a full body, came back, had a protein shake with some L-glutamine, which is now finished. I have since then just been working. Um, me and my husband were actually looking at some cinema tickets because we want to go to the cinema. There's quite a few good films out at the moment. I don't know when this vlog is actually going to be up because there's a lot of moving vlogs before this. I don't know if this is going to be like put in midweek or if I'll just wait to post this. Ah, but that is me. Booked some cinema tickets. Did some work. It's now half past 12. I think I've said that already. I just went downstairs to make myself a... Well, make myself. Pour myself a kombucha. I bought some, you would have seen in my Starbucks haul in the London vlog and if you didn't, go back and watch it, thank you. Uh, but I, we went to Starbucks for our journey home because it's like a, it's a long journey. We don't live in London so it's like a three, four hour journey to where we are. So we got some Starbucks and I saw this cup sitting on the shelf. Now I don't know if the camera is doing it justice, but anyone who knows me and if you guys have watched me, you know that I'm all about neutrals and gold. I'm not a silver person, I'm not a grey person, I'm not a... what are the knots am I? I don't know, but one thing I am is white and gold and iridescent 
and that is the theme of my office even though my office is a tip right now but I have like iridescent things in my office because I love I think it's just like the most beautiful obviously like the nice iridescent not the I'm not gonna say anything but anyways the nice iridescent kind of color like the clear crystal that's got an iridescence to it that's the kind like a pearlescent um what's the other word that they call it I don't know but anyways this cup and I don't know if the camera is picking it up but it is a combination of both it is gold but it is also iridescent like and I wish the sun was out it's such a gloomy day today but I wish the sun was out because I feel like that would give you even more of an idea of how beautiful this cup is like she is our new baby she is our new baby we love her down to the lid on the straw hello hello so yes this is our new babes um i don't know where or if you can still buy it when this comes out i haven't checked on uh, the starbucks app if it's like available but maybe if you go in store um i will try to post this vlog as soon as possible so that if some of you guys do want to get it you can but if you can't i'm sorry and a sauce parcel you know you ordered a lot from asos when it comes in a box <laughs> um so i'll quickly take you guys through what i got i was like where is the skirt that i bought i'm sitting on it uh, right it needs ironing anyway because it's crushed as i was gonna say crushed as out um but it's crushed as anything so first things first these beautiful sunglasses they remind me of the balenciaga um cat eye sunglasses in the like cow pattern type but they're not <laughs> because i'm not spending that amount of money on sunglasses so she's giving she's giving she's giving she's giving <laughs> but yeah they are beautiful um as some of you guys i'm trying to focus okay i want you guys to see the details you may know i am traveling at the end of this year traveling um so i've got this section of my wardrobes it's just the bit that's off camera but this section of my wardrobe is like all my holiday things um and all my outfits put together because we're going for a yeah yeah i'm not gonna say too much anyways <laughs> second up these beautiful sunglasses that are in this like yes there we go in this like pearlescent can you guys tell that i like like pearlescent marble onyx type vibes um again she's giving don't mind the hair today i have the fro out um but just imagine this it's on a beach braids by the pool with a cocktail oh honey don't talk to me don't talk to me that's all i'm gonna say that's all i'm gonna say um the first set of sunglasses are from river island and these are from asos they i bought them all on asos but the brand River Island ASOS. Um, next up, 
Next up, I got some jewelry. So I got these two beautiful um, gold plated rings. They're 24 karat gold um, because I'm fed up of buying cheap jewelry that changes color all the time. So these are those. So one has like all the diamond tea on it and then the other one is like half diamond tea but they're both like knots and I thought that was like quite nice you know tying the knot love unity family all of that nice stuff so and this is how oh if I can put it on my finger I literally just wore these like two minutes ago this is how it looks on the hand Beautiful, 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 beautiful. So yeah, got those two. Um, next up I got this ring, which is just a twist design thing. Um, I got it in the, from the curve section so like for the curvy women um and I got it in a size small but it's still like too big for me um I do have very let's say slender fingers um so my rings are quite small it's okay like it's fine it fits but it moves it moves around just a little bit so I'm thinking maybe to get one of those like plastic things that you put on the back of your ring to make the ring fit um it is 24 karat gold again but I don't I don't think I can get the smaller size I don't think there was a smaller size I'll double check but I still love it and I'll probably just keep it as it is um yeah so all of this is for the holiday all of it is for the holiday. Obviously the jewellery I'll wear afterwards and the sunglasses but it's all bought for the holiday. Next up this skirt. Now this is from Misguided from ASOS <laughs> um, and it's just a linen type ruched skirt. I'll try and find the picture and put it on screen and um, I doubt this will still be available because I struggled to even get this um, and I got it in my basket and I think it was the last one I think it was the last one in this size and I think there was one more small size available but this is a size 10 and um, I tried it on and it fits like an absolute glove it looks so good and it reaches just like to my feet so the bottom of the skirt fits like just to where my feet are um in terms of like it touches it's just off the ground almost um depending on obviously how high or low you wanted to wear it but i'm gonna wear it like mid waist um but yeah it fits like an absolute glove absolutely beautiful great texture and material also has an underskirt which I absolutely love. Not that it needs it because the material actually isn't thin. Um, probably in daylight it's a bit thinner. But yeah, it's got a nice little rope detail. This doesn't actually do anything, it's just sewn on. So, but yeah. We love her. We love her. So, yeah, that was the skirt again for holiday. And yeah, that was pretty much it. Um, the rest of the stuff that I got was all skincare. So I picked up three skincare products. Um, probably not of any interest to you, but I'll put them here so that you can see them. I've put them in the bathroom, so that's why I don't want to go get them. Um, and then, last but not least, I got some skincare tools because at the moment I have a very, 
very simplistic skincare routine like literally I'm talking I wash my face and I use a glycolic acid wipe um, to help with my scarring and hyperpigmentation and then I moisturize and that is it so I'm trying to take it up a notch um, I'm trying to experiment again with very specific products that I think will do benefits for my skin and I've researched these products as well to see what benefit they have like getting rid of my hyperpigmentation because that's the main issue for me and then just obviously helping with texture because I have a lot of like under skin bumps um, not a lot but yeah so I'm hoping the products will help with that I also have products that I've had from before that hopefully I can kind of use more consistently and hopefully we'll see a difference so I thought I would get a skin roller Um, this one is from Revlon again all of this was from ASOS as well I want things that are gonna help my skin but the only brands that they sold were Revlon, Revolution, sorry, not Revlon, Revolution and Psychic Sisters. Now, as a person who has a faith, um, first of all, the name Psychic Sisters, I was like, hmm, okay. But then I read the description and it talks about how they do tarot cards and um, the stones and you know like how people have like amethyst stones and energy stones and all of that um, and they do that through like skincare tools now for me as a person of faith I don't um, take part in things like tarot readings psychic readings um, stone energies universal energies manifesting all of that is not it doesn't align with my faith and what my faith teaches so as a person of faith I feel like there is a line where you have to be quite careful with the things that you interact with and the things that you buy things that you listen to the things that you watch the things that yeah the things that you listen to so I think for me it was just I'm gonna just be cautious I don't have anything against the brand I don't know the brand um but yeah it was just I respect other people's decisions and what they decide to do and if they're fine with that or if they see nothing in that then that's absolutely fine um, but for me yeah and I'd hope that people would respect my decision for that as well and not um, buying products from an organisation or company that um, puts tarot readings and spirituality behind their products that is not the spirituality that is my spirituality so that was a long spiel for nothing um <laughs> but if you want to to buy one then that's absolutely fine um not to say that revolution don't have things behind their products but it's not in their messaging it's not something that they um portray or put out as like this is a facial roller that is made of white jade and white jade is a stone that exudes this energy and protects you against this and you know use this and it'll enhance your skin but also to help your energy like that's not their message where psychic sisters message is more like that and I'm not going to speak on things I don't know um but yeah so that's why got a facial roller gosh and then I've got a rose quartz geisha gua sha geisha gua sha gua sha um one of these one of these yeah and again, I don't know 
anything about rose quartz or what it does um they don't put anything about it on their products or in the description about anything like that so yeah this is this is that i tried to if they had a, a white jade one obviously i would have got that white always but this was the closest i could get which was like a pale pink rose quartz but i think they're both like super super cute so yeah that was my asos haul i hope that you guys enjoyed um not much else to report i am waiting for my husband to get home with lunch <laughs> because he went to greg's to get a sandwich and I just got a pastry there's nothing more to it we came back yesterday there is no food in this house so it is what it is I got my kombucha I'm gonna have my pastry I should be on lunch now but I need to send off this PO or raise this PO and then we should be good to go i feel like i've been talking and it's going to have logged me out of this po and oh yes yeah. oh uh. okay let's raise this po and have a break <laughs> Hi lovelies and welcome back. Um, as you can see, my surroundings are slightly different. Ta da! Don't mind the mess. I'm in the family office. Um, I'm currently staying at my mom's house for the week, um, which is really nice because I haven't seen them for a while. So yeah this is us i'm not gonna speak too much because i literally have a meeting in like a minute it is currently tuesday but yeah i just thought i'd bring you guys along on my week when i'm not at home different setting different surroundings all of that good stuff so yeah I was working with that from my previous role as well and um, so the main things within that are uh, um, it's definitely more international staff um, and then I think there's probably about uh, 10 or 20 percent of us who are probably UK staff so yeah okay okay but the yes yes yeah mm. 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 Oh, I like this one. I know. Oh. There's nothing much in there. No. no. <laughs> this is very light. Yeah. And that's only 50. 40. 40. That's good. Oh, mom. So we're in Saki with some boots. I'm seeing that the price is quite too much. It's gonna
been at my mom's obviously for the whole week I didn't vlog much just because one I was obviously working all week still um, but also there wasn't actually much that we were doing in terms of stuff that I could vlog for you guys um, and when I go to my mom's I do go for a bit of almost like respite so it's very chill and very laid back um, I was I obviously work from home so it was a lot of working from home and then in the evenings cooking dinner having dinner chilling together watching a movie watching a series um, I've put a few clips that you guys would have seen we went shopping to find my sister <laughs> some stuff that was a whole palaver and it ended up being more of a palaver, but I won't get into that. So she had to go back the next day to get the rest of her stuff with my mom. And then yesterday evening, we actually ended up going to the cinema. I, uh, the movie finished at like half 10. So by the time we got home, I had a shower, put on my pajamas, um, my sister and mom were watching a movie, so I just kind of chilled, but I fell asleep after like 10 minutes <laughs> on the sofa. So then at midnight, my mom was like, okay, bedtime. So then we all just ended up going to bed. This morning, had a lay-in, stayed in bed till about 11. I woke up about 10, just before 10, um, and stayed in bed probably till just got 11. Mom cooked breakfast, which was really nice maybe some vegetarian sausages and then I packed we watched some She-Hulk and now I am on my way home I hope that you guys week and days are going good I hope that you've had some time for some respite this week if you haven't please do because it's important it's always important to take time out for yourself even if it's just half an hour a whole day if you can afford to take a whole day take it even if it's just half an hour of getting away from life if it's that you have to take half an hour to sit in the bath and just listen to some music drink whatever it is that you want to drink if you need a glass of wine or something read a book or watch your favorite youtuber or watch a movie or part of a movie or an episode of your favorite series just take some time out to relax and have your mind unwind speak to you guys soon Selling fan blowing cold breeze on your body I can't tell you really what it is, but you got it Make up in the morning, you got dresses in your closet But you grab them tight, you in love with being modest You a mood body, giving scenic views I'm just saying I'm a mute But you ain't even